Yeah, CBS 42 news reporter Jack Royer is at Regions Field tonight with this fascinating story. Yeah, Sherry and Jim, even in the rain, coming to a Barons baseball game for us is just one of life's simple pleasures. But for Cameron Stovall, it represents a triumph over one of life's most incredible challenges. And it's one of the most incredible success stories you may have ever heard. For our national pastime, it's the sounds and the sights that make it memorable. But imagine a baseball game with no sights at all. For Cameron Stovall, this night almost looked a lot different. You know, I played baseball and, uh, you know, it was easy for me then. The 26 year old was left completely blind in 2014 when shotgun pellets hit both his eyes in a bird hunting accident. There's long been little hope for patients like him. But thanks to years of research and intense surgery, two doctors were able to restore useful vision to Cam's left eye. What could have failed him is a test called no light perception. Most doctors test an eye's ability to see light, and if it can't, it's long been thought that nothing could be done. But doctors Robert Morris and Jay Glover knew otherwise. Morris leads the Helen Keller Foundation and has performed thousands of eye surgeries in a decades long career. You know, go for it. Do everything you can. That's the standard for every severe eye injury now, uh, and Cam Stovall proves it. I think it's just not giving up on people at any point. You know, however dark it looks, that there's always some hope out there, and um, and just never give up. Now, plenty for Cam to see on a rainy Thursday three years later, as he throws the first pitch to the doctor who helped save his vision. It sounds crazy, but I wouldn't change my accident happening because I've been able to encourage so many people on a daily basis, and I feel blessed because of that. It's certainly been a roller coaster, but you know, I feel like I'm at the end of it now and enjoying life, you know. A brush with blindness met life-changing medical research to help Cameron Stovall keep his eye on the ball. Just one of the most incredible stories we could have ever heard. Dr. Morris says it's revolutionary in the medical community, and he hopes his research and this success story for Cam can give many more people many more years of vision when they may not have had it otherwise. Reporting live in downtown Birmingham, Jack Royer, CBS 42 News, local coverage you can count on.